Hello, I'm Asif Farouk of Finextra, and we're here today with Andre Kirilenko, Professor of the Practice of Finance at the MIT Sloan School of Management and former Chief Economist of the CFTC. So your presentation today was on automated markets and institutions. How do you think we progress with the ideas you've put forward today? Right, so today at, at the conference, I was here at the conference organized by the uh, LSE and SWIFT and the SWIFT Institute. And uh, the main gist of my presentation was uh, that there could be things lost in translation. So and there are lawyers writing regulations. And then at the end of the line, there is a program developer who has to actually translate it into lines of code. What I was suggesting is that we could provide an intellectual framework to this so we can approach each regulation as some sort of an integrated circuit and uh, have some sort of schema that would then uh, program developers understand. And the legal issues around it is that if, if there is a way to think of implementing this particular schema in a sort of a safe, safe harbor sort of fashion where you, could, uh, if you, you can implement a, a regulation in, in, in a way that you think is most meaningful, uh, but if you do this, if there is a sort of a prescribed at the logical level way to do it, then you have some safe harbor. You've actually done your compliance with a regulation. So that, that's a, that sort of provides a, a, if I will, a thought leadership and intellectual leadership to the sort of void between um, uh, regulations written in, in, in a certain way, which is more consistent with sort of human operated markets, and the reality of markets basically running on millions and millions of lines of code. And as an academic and a uh, former regulator, how do you see the industry moving forward? I think a way to move forward on this is for the uh, for major stakeholders to come together, but in a way that the regulators could take a critical part in it. For example, it could be done in the context of a roundtable or, or a committee organized by different regulators, because uh, regulators can essentially only use for regulatory purposes things that are on formally on public record, uh, on the record in the context of, of a roundtable organized by regulators or a committee hearing or something of that nature. But stakeholders definitely need to be brought together. In this space, the stakeholders are many. They are people who are data vendors. They are stakeholders who are financial institutions. They're exchanges. They're regulators themselves. So the way to bring them together in, the, in, the, in a meaningful way and discuss, uh, again, uh, organize them around this concept of how can we provide within the regulation uh, an, an, an architecture of how things could be uh, implemented by uh, software developers.